Hey, happy Halloween, you guys. I'm starting my overnight shift. It's a little after 7 p.m. I'm headed to a Burger King. Six dollar Burger King for a couple miles. It's a pretty big order for a six dollar. Plus there's a dollar peak pay, so. Two meals, so two drinks and a third drink. Not a very good tip on this one at the BK. Lobby's locked at 7.15 p.m. Welcome back, what can I get for you? Hey, I got DoorDash for John. Okay, so I want to thank you. Thank you. Three dollar tip for that big ass order. <laughs> Here's a little Caesars. This one's a little better. Going to a house. I'll take that. They're trying to add a, another two stops to this guy's Screw this Little Caesars customer over. I think it's going out of my, above my boundary line to the 60 freeway. Yep. No way. Pizza, pizza. Full. It's there. That one was a hand it to me and he came out and waited on his front porch so perfect still got that dollar peak pay and they're not letting me extend past 8 it's 7.38 oh there we go another half hour here's a four stop order with a grocery store for terrible pay. That's not gonna get done anytime soon. Here's a Taco Bell going to a house and it's taking me back down near my house, so for sure. So they were standing out on their sidewalk and handed it to him through the window. Love that. Another 650. Can I extend any more? Nope. 830. 21 bucks. Since 715. Here's a Papa John's going to a house. Three and a half miles. I love that restaurant. I'm all over that one. Looks like there's a bunch of people waiting. Fucking lobby's full. Cool, it was ready. Just had to wait for the crowd to clear out of my way. I think somebody unassigned that because it was already at the pickup time when I got it. All right, they were in their driveway doing candy, doing Halloween. So the peak pay went away, which is good. 
allows me to get more orders. Let's see if I can extend. Yep, nine o'clock. 21 bucks, less than an hour. 10 minutes, less than an hour. Actually, that was 28 bucks. It wasn't cleared. There's still a lot of trick-or-treaters out. Eight oh six. They're still at it. Here's a really stupid one. This one's a wing stop and a target. <laughs> Who pairs these things up? Why would you do a a shop with a food? I guess that's going to the same house, so that's why. Stupid though. All right, I think I'm gonna, I've been thinking about it for a while, but I'm gonna do this. <laughs> Raising canes for 10 bucks. What the hell is this? Never seen that before. I had to pull over. I'm not gonna do this, I'm gonna decline this. So why would I take this if it's got deactivation warnings on the order? Cool, don't have to do it. A Raising Cane's order could have sen sensitive medical information, is that what it said? I should have screenshotted that. Has anybody ever seen that before? Warning you that you can't give up any of the information. I'm definitely not gonna take that during a ride along video. But that reminds me of this morning I got, I did a Starbucks to a regular customer at a daycare and it, it's, it's holding the pay for, for review. Let me show you. Held due to review for a nine dollar Starbucks. And I clicked on like more information and it said something about suspected fraud. So I was again waiting to wake up and, and see the email that I'm deactivated. So there's no way that I'm going to take that order that, that, that you just saw. It's, it's got a deactivation warning on it. If you, who would take that? Like, gives you the chance to back, back out of it and click decline. I'm, I'm never taking that, ever. If any order ever says that, I'm declining it. Pita Jungle is like a little bit more expensive restaurant. Got a two dollar one. Here's the screenshot when I went to look at my pay and found out that order was under review. When we detect potential delivery issues, routine manual review. I guess I'm gonna have to take this if it's a house. Cause I'm getting nothing but road trip offers. I haven't been showing you all the declines. That Pizza Hut, pizza places are packed according to the Papa John's, so let's hope that it's not an hour wait. That's the one that made me wait 40 minutes for no reason during a ride along video. Oh, that was during a live.
I don't think that order was obeyed. <laughs> I only waited a couple minutes on that Pizza Hut. All right, six bucks. Higher base pay, cheap tip. It's 837. I'm only on till nine. I'm on till ten now. Thirty-four bucks. Alright, I'm gonna take this ten dollar Papa John's. <clears throat> Going to a house. The same neighborhood I just left. The islands. The islands in Gilbert. I used to pest control there. All right, they look like they're still kind of busy. A couple people. All right, I got it quickly. I'm gonna pizza bag this, even though it's not required. It's not a super short drive. Got it all thermaled up. saying to take a picture of the receipt. <laughs> no receipt. I've already bagged it, jackasses. Let's see how far it is. 11 minutes. Alright, they're partying in their driveway. So that was a hand to them. Looks like the trick-or-treaters are gonna start clearing out soon. Oh shit, it says to take a photo. And it, 10 bucks. Higher base pay. 44 bucks, nine o'clock. Those people had some, some glasses of wine going. <laughs> Let's see if I can extend it. Nope. All right, I think I'm gonna do this, even though it's really cheap, but I was at that Pizza Hut earlier and it wasn't as busy as the Papa John's, so I'm hoping that I get the order. Let's go into a house. It's just one pizza, so hope it's ready for 5.25. Both orders have already been picked up, according to the Pizza Hut. Both of those two orders have been picked up, so that's gonna gonna take a while to. I think I have to call on them separately. I think I'm just gonna unassign these. 
because I don't want to waste the time. It says my it says it's worry free. I don't believe that. I gotta do the next one. And they might accuse you of lying on that too. Anything you do on DoorDash can get you fired. No more. I'm not going to take any more from this restaurant tonight. Let's check my completion rate. Down. It was at 100, so they lied. Here's another Raising Canes to a house. I'm right by it, so I'm going to try that. Let's so see if it See if it gives me that warning. Nope. So let's hope it's not a huge order. Two items. Two combos. I've never had a Raisin Cane's that didn't have a drink. Ever. I just started doing them, so I've only done like 10. Doesn't look too, too packed. There's some empty parking spots. <laughs> That's spendy. So the Canes is just as fast as any other restaurant. Sometimes faster. I, I did a members only video on it. On my first Canes, Raising Canes delivery, but the even though you have to place the order when you get there and pay with the red card, it's still totally doable. If it's the dollar a mile is good, I take them now. So let's go drop this off. All right, there's no porch light, but they probably are done with trick or treaters. So. Seven fifty with a good tip. So we're at fifty one fifty and nine thirty three PM. Alright, I'm gonna take this Taco Bell, go into a house. The lobby's still unlocked till ten. So. Drive through's got a long line. I might be waiting a little bit. No orders. So it's been about 15 minutes here at the Taco Bell. It's past the pickup time. Pick up by 9.40, it's 9.52. So. They're telling a bunch of people that the orders have already been picked up. I told like five drivers that the order's already been picked up by someone else. <laughs> All right, I'm leaving the Taco Bell at 9.57. Finally got the order. It's just a small bag, no drinks. The drive through is still as, as long as it was when I got here. And that's all they care about is the drive through so. Why I waited so long. So this guy should be furious. This customer should be pissed. If my order took that long, I'd want to give a bad rating myself. So that was only five fifty for like a half hour of work. So 
so that kills my dollar an hour. Here's an alcohol. I'm not gonna do. Way too cheap for that distance. So 57 bucks. Still not bad. It's just after 10 p.m. All right, here's a five item short distance CVS order. So after that Taco Bell wait, I'm all over this one. It's up to me how fast I do it. There's the Taco Bell line. <laughs> All right, I got that all shopped super fast. Headed to the customer's house. All right, got it all done. Eight twenty-five, four dollar tip. Higher base pay, it should be for the shops. 65, 25, 10, 18 p.m. Here's a Walgreens. It's not my Walgreens. That's to an apartment, a terrible apartment complex. I'm not gonna do it. That would be easy. I would have done it if it was out of my Dobson and Warner store, but I actually want those shops right now because the restaurants can't handle the busyness. So this is a double order. And this CVS is next door to a McDonald's, but they're sending you to another McDonald's. I'm not even sure the hours of that store. But the the three items is really only one item three times. So I usually don't go for this, but because of the... I don't think that McDonald's over there in, in Gilbert will be as busy, so I'm going to try it. Oh, I lost it. Never mind. <laughs> I was talking about it too much. Let's see if it comes back. All right, it did come back, which kind of actually worries me a little bit. But I might just unassign the McDonald's if it's closed and then hope that they put the bigger tip on the CVS part of the order. It's the same house. Both orders go to the same customer, so let's give it a try. This McDonald's here is open till midnight on the weeknights, 24 hours on Friday and Saturday nights and it's right next door to the CVS so they should have they should have chose this McDonald's here but we'll see we'll find out what the hours are when we get to the other Mickey D's oh shit 7.49 so might be this one There's only two, damn it. That's not it. The other one's only got one. This one's got the same color. Stripe on it. It's only one, there's only one of them. So they're probably gonna be pissed if they, especially if they don't get their Mickey D's. Yep, that's it, and there's only one. <laughs> Shit. So now it's glitching out. If you have your extra care card, please scan it now. Place your item in the bagging area. Scan coupon now. Your total is, please wait, sis.
Thank you for shopping at CVS. Please remove all, all bagged, bagged items. items. All right, here's the Cooper and Warner Mickey D's. I think I saw people in the drive-thru. So good, I hope it's open so this customer's not as, as upset. Oh, it's pretty busy. Not as bad as the one, one by the CVS. Did you mobile app today? I've got a DoorDash. 2FE. 2FE. Awesome. Second window, please. Thank you. The delivery order? Yeah, it's All two. Alright, you mind tell me those two last two? 2FE. 2FE? Alright, yeah. I'll right out for you. Thank you. Alright, I scored the Mickey D's. It took a little while, but I gotta put in the code 2FE. So hopefully the customer is not too upset that they only got one pantyhose. All right, let's close this one out. The hell? Oh, it's making me take the picture again. I've already left their door and they've already grabbed their stuff. Wasn't this 15 the first time? How the hell did it go down a, a quarter? <laughs> Wing stop for 750. And it's headed back towards the zone. So cool, I'll do that one. To a house. Sweet. So we're at 80 bucks plus the pending wing stop one almost 11. They won't let me extend past 11. It's only seven minutes to go, so I might be might be out of luck after this one. Wing stop. All right, we got the wing stop. Said it's one of these. <laughs> All right, this dash is going to be over. Is that different? Yep. Forty three cents higher. Now it's excited to show me that I can't work. So it skips my summary. So I'll have to pull it up for you. Still got that $9 held for review. Where is it? There it is, $87.93 for Halloween night. So it's over 20 bucks an hour, not bad. It's about, better than normal. Halloween was busier. I only had, if you can avoid the long waits at the restaurants, I only had one bad one. That, that Taco Bell was the only, only one I would mention that sucked. So, this should be turning red. If I make it home, I'm going to end the video and upload it. If not, I'll do some more. Show you some more. It's got to be red. It's got to be busy. If every if every other neighboring zone is red, then this is busy also. All right, it's gray, but it, I was scheduled at 11:30, so but I'm turning on to my street now. So I'm gonna probably just call this the video, make it a 30-minute video. So I'll dash now. Maybe I'll show you if I, if I get something. Open. But I can upload, start this video uploading, leave my my camera phone in the house on the Wi-Fi, and nothing's popping up right now. 
So I'm gonna keep going till around 9 a.m. Let me know if you guys, what, should I try and do a full shift ride along? It'd probably be like hour and a half, two hour video. Let me know in the comments. It's 11 right now and I started it. That's exactly four hours. I showed you four hours. Almost exactly. So I work like 14. So that would be a long, that would be, you know, well over an hour long video, close to two maybe. I've thought about trying it, but never done it. All right, let me know what you think about that weird Cane's chicken warning about the giving up the customer information and then has anybody had that happen with the order being withheld, the payment for the order being withheld? What the hell? The only thing I could think of that was suspicious is I did it too damn fast because Starbucks was, was, I was doing like, I did like 10 Starbucks in a row and they were, they had them ready each time and it was just kicking ass. Here comes an order I won't do. Too far, too big of a road trip. I love doing the CVS and Walgreens, but I'm not going to travel down there and have to get back. Suppositories. <laughs> All right, hope you enjoyed that video. Sorry if I recorded some of my, I think I might have recorded some of my cup holder, like didn't pause it, but make sure you catch the live, Sunday Night Live. It's going to be my special birthday edition. My birthday is coming up on Sunday, November 3rd, so... All right, appreciate you guys that watched the whole thing. Thanks a lot. That's it for now. We'll talk soon. Later.